Energizing your soul through the inspired Word of God. This is your daily devotional reading. My Life Today, a devotional by Ellen White. November 24th, with humility. Christ only Christ, no idle words e'er falling. Christ only Christ, no needless bustling sound. Christ only Christ, no self-important bearing. Christ only Christ, no trace of I be found. With humility. A man's pride shall bring him low, but honor shall uphold the humble in spirit. Proverbs chapter 29 verse 23. Man may lift himself up in pride and boast of his power, but in an instant, God can bring him to nothingness. It is Satan's work to lead men to glorify themselves with their entrusted talents. Every man through whom God works will have to learn that the living, ever-present, ever-acting God is supreme and has lent him talents to use an intellect to originate, a heart to be the seat of his throne, affections to flow out in blessing to all with whom he shall come in contact, a conscience through which the Holy Spirit can convict him of sin, of righteousness, and of judgment. Pride, ignorance, and folly are constant companions. The Lord is displeased with the pride manifested among his professed people. Parents, it is easier for you to teach your children a lesson of pride than a lesson of humility. Before honor is humility, to fill a high place before men. Heaven chooses the worker who takes a lowly place before God. The most childlike disciple is the most efficient in labor for God. The heavenly intelligences can cooperate with him who is seeking not to exalt self, but to save souls. From communion with Christ, he will go forth to work for those who are perishing in their sins. He is anointed for his mission, and he succeeds where many of the learned and intellectually wise would fail. The simplicity of The self-forgetfulness and the confiding love of a little child are the attributes that heaven values. These are the characteristics of real greatness. Solomon was never so rich or so wise or so truly great as when he confessed, I am but a little child. I know not how to go out or come in. My life today November 24th. I encourage you to be ye doers of the word and not hearers only. Thank you for listening and be sure to join us tomorrow for your daily devotional reading.